everybody, welcome back to Tech with Brett. Today I'm going to talk about what a Chromecast is. The Chromecast allows you to convert any TV that has an HDMI port into a smart TV. All you have to do is plug this into the back of the device and set it up through the Google Home app and you then now have a smart TV. So there are a few different types of Chromecasts. You have ones that do video, ones that do audio, and ones that are actually built in to devices that you already have. If you watched my last video, you saw the Google Home. And the Google Home acts as a cast device. So at any time, I can play music from my phone right to the Google Home and listen to it there. So there are two types of video devices. You have the basic one that's normally a $35 Chromecast. And then you also have the Ultra Chromecast, which is a new $69 Chromecast. And it adds 4K as well as HDR features. So I'm just going to talk about the basic Chromecast that you can get for $35. So this is super easy to use. The Chromecast sits and plays different pictures. And you can set up your own pictures. It will also tell you different things like you can add the weather as well as the time. So let me show you how to use the Chromecast. So there are many different applications that you can use to cast to your Chromecast. So is what I mean by cast, that is to send a video or picture to your Chromecast. And it's how that works is your Chromecast will connect directly to your Wi-Fi network, and then it will go and fetch the video and play it on your Chromecast device independently of your phone. So here's an example. I'm gonna go into YouTube, and you will know if you can Chromecast if you see this cast icon up at the top. So that will show up when you have a Chromecast nearby that you can cast to. So if I want to, let's say I go to a video that I want to cast, and while I'm playing it, I hit that cast button and then I can choose which device I want it to send it to. So here I'm going to select the bedroom and you can see I have different Chromecast devices. So here it is now broadcasting YouTube on the TV. And the great part about this is since the Chromecast is fetching the video, I can continue to use my phone independently and it will still play even if I am in the app or not. One of the great parts about the Chromecast, if you have multiple people in the room that have a Chromecast and they're on your same Wi-Fi network, they now have control over the video as well. So they can pause it and stop the video or you can. So I'm gonna hit close there. Another application that you can use is Google Photos. I go into the Google Photos app, I see the Chromecast icon, and then I select the device I want the picture to show up on and it will just show that picture. If I go back, I can select a different picture and then that will show up on the TV and not the other pictures on my phone. You can find different Chromecast apps by searching on the Google Play Store or there will be a link to this video to find those. This will also work on Android phones as well as iPhones or tablets. Let's say you own a movie that you wanna to send to the TV. All you need to do is go to the app where that movie is, hit the cast icon again, choose where you want to send that video, and then I just tap on the video and it will play on that device. I hope you were able to learn a few things about the Chromecast today. If you did, make sure you smash that like button in the bottom of the video or hit the subscribe button. That really helps me out so that I can continue to make more of these videos and teach you how to master technology. Thanks again for joining me and we'll catch you tomorrow when I give you five hidden tricks that you can use on the Chromecast. See you then.